Hey vlog, it's been ages since I last posted. It's getting on for like six months now and a lot has happened. First off, I've been getting healthier. So obviously I've been dancing and then at the beginning of the year, I started sorting my diet out. I've been walking a lot more. Now that the sun's out, I'm back to cycling to work daily. And then over the last few weeks, a couple of mornings a week, I've been going for like a jog of a morning. Uh, with small weights attached to like my ankles and my, my wrists. And then later this week, I'm going to begin resistance training uh, for the first time in years. Uh, whilst getting healthier, I've consumed a lot more content. So I've sort of nerded out on the Infinite Monkey Cage podcasts from the BBC. Uh, I listened to and watched a lot from Real Social Dynamics, RSD, RSD Tyler. Don't Google that and also Tim Ferriss and Gary V, Gary Vaynerchuk. Uh, and there was a guest on one of these podcasts. I can't remember exactly which one because I've, I've listened to so many whilst running and walking and cycling. Uh, so I can't give the, the proper credit to them. But one of the guests made the observation that they find it really interesting when they see someone on social media or vlogging and they're pumping out like a crazy amount of content and then they just go quiet and fall off the grid for a while. And this is usually seen as a bad thing because it's not consistent for the audience. Uh, but he said he finds it really interesting because these are the kind of people that have gone away, they've learned something, they've developed, they've grown, and now they've come back to share that knowledge and share those experiences that they've had. So hopefully that's going to be the case here because over the last six months I've been really, really busy. Uh, so yeah, uh, a lot of you know that I started swing dancing, uh, like Lindy Hop, uh, what, like last September, so less than a year ago, uh, just as a break from like the, the nine to half five day job, uh, the tech meetups that I attend of weekday evenings, and all the, the coding I do of evenings and weekends. Uh, so yeah, it, was, it just started as like a, a Sunday evening, something different to do, uh, and then especially over the last six months, it's really uh, crept in and consume my life. So in January, I started also attending Mersey Swing of Wednesday evenings. Uh, and then I've been going to like weekenders as well. So I went, I went to Lead Swing Revolution. I went up to, to Hull for uh, Hulls of Popping. These are like three, four day weekend events where it's classes all day, socials at night, just nonstop dancing, plenty of uh, energy drinks we can consume during those days of dancing. Uh, but then, yeah, loads of other uh, swing and jazz music events as well where we've been dancing. So uh, I went to like Namwich Jazz Festival. Uh, I went to the Swinging Spring Ball at Blackpool Tower because the Dancing Blackpool Ballroom was on my bucket list of things to do. So I can definitely tick that off now. Uh, and then, yeah, just like dancing to jazz bands at the, the uh, Baltic Market in Liverpool with Mersey Swing. I went to Mersey Swing's fifth anniversary party as well in Liverpool. Uh, and then, yeah, like yesterday, just dancing at uh, the bandstand in Chester with some of the Cheshire Swing Cats. Sometimes we'll take a sound system and, and dance in Chester Park as well in the sun. So yeah, that's kind of the, the dance. All these, all these uh, topics I'll probably do a separate vlog on. Uh, so yeah, my whole swing journey will be uh, could be a whole series, honestly. But yeah, I'm also back to the uh, tech meetups as well. I had a little bit of a break from them, but I'm back to Chester Dev. So I attended that the other week. That was on uh, blockchain, less about crypto, but more blockchain technology. I'm back to the Chester SEO and digital marketing meetup uh, organized by Craig Campbell and, and Andy Drinkwater. They come down to Chester once a month. So I'm back in attendance to that. Uh, and I've also picked up a few new ones. So last week I attended the first... Uh, WordPress meetup in Liverpool uh, and then CodeUp as well. I'm still co-organizer with CodeUp Chester so that's definitely grown. We're seeing a lot more attendance there at the Story House. We've been having like organizer meetings. Uh, we've got like some events planned that we're we're going to be promoting and um, we were also on Flipside Radio, a uh, local radio station in Chester as well the other week promoting it. So there's plenty going on there. So I'm sure we'll be vlogging about a lot of these uh, tech meetups and tech developments that are going on. Uh, and then, yeah, loads of other just things that have changed in my life. So I've moved house, so I live in Hull now. It's more central Chester. Got myself a hamster, a little Syrian hamster, black and white hamster. Uh, called him Siri because I wanted a, 
a tech name and then yeah i guess i guess i'll leave it there but uh actually another thing as well i went down a bit of a youtube and podcast audio uh rabbit hole as well around like spirituality so all these topics i'll probably do vlogs on but uh yeah i'm really gonna have to think about how uh how to cover that one without being all like energy and crystals and things but that all started with a a documentary uh well, not a documentary a movie by wayne dyer called the shift uh and then that just yeah sent me spinning down all these these uh like alice in wonderland spinning down all these holes uh looking up things on uh on youtube as well so yeah i'll probably have links to all these all these things in the comments in the uh in the description below uh but yeah cool i'll i'll catch you up soon